My dear viewers, welcome to today's reading. Today being Thursday, November 23, 2023. And this reading is for the whole collective, for each and every one of us. I hope you'll enjoy it. I hope it guides you and supports you in every way to know what's happening and what is coming. I'd like to take this opportunity to wish a happy birthday to those of you celebrating today. I wish you a glorious birthday and a beautiful day. And for those of you celebrating anniversaries, I also wish you happy anniversaries and a beautiful day. For each and every one of you, my dear viewers, um, thank you for being here. We've got the joy, which is so beautiful. Happiness and joy. Uh, my dear viewers, yes, uh, each and every one of you, I wish you a lot of blessings in everything you do. So, my dear viewers, I could not take that because my intention was there for today. So, we've got joy and happiness. This is about joy is the highest energy of all. Happiness and joy is the highest energy of all. It's the magical sense that everything is possible. Joy springs from appreciating the gifts within each moment. Joy allows you to attract and create your present and future moments at their highest possible levels. So happiness, joy is the message of today. Beautiful. Now let's see what the sacred forest has to add to this. What's the message for today? And it says success. Success, a secret spring. Something's going to happen around spring. Something surprising, perhaps. Something that's going to be revealing itself. And it's going to bring you a lot of success and freedom. Freedom transcending where you are from today. Like where you are now, you're going to be transcending to higher levels. Uh, and you are going to have your freedom and a lot of success. Success to the highest level. Okay, beautiful. Let's see four major impacts that will impact everybody. November 23rd, starting with the first one. Wow. A new beginning. Something wonderful is igniting, something spectacular. Some new beginning that is going to bring you abundance of happiness. Abundance itself is going to be very fruitful, very supportive. Very, It's a wonderful, wonderful new beginning that's going to bring you a lot of joy and happiness. It could be the beginning of a new relationship, a new project. We'll clarify, I'll clarify it and we'll find out more about it. Okay, the second one, we have the two of cups which is all about union a sacred union a wonderful union a partnership that is probably from past lives someone that you can connect with on a very high level work well together heal together become strong together and create so much together so if you're starting some business with someone it's going to be absolutely wonderful this person's going to be wonderful wow we have the nine of cups wishes and dreams and desires being granted wishes being granted my dear viewers whatever you've been dreaming wishing wanting trying to manifest praying for they're all about to come true so prepare for a lot of emotional fulfillment you're going to be happy in many areas of your life dreams coming true it's a beautiful card the nine of cups then we've got the nine of pentacles someone very hard work or hard work nearly going to reach your goals almost there and you are going to reach your goals ultimately and it could be someone very helpful and supportive and helping you reach your goals also someone of earth energy such as Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn or could be even yourself I also feel like uh, there is some news coming from someone of earth energy have a look at your general reading under your star sign you'll know who this person is what you don't see happening or coming is emotional fulfillment someone is going to be um, perhaps needing more from you than you are anticipating to give why I say that is because we have got um, the hanged man and the hanged man shows that maybe you need to put your interest aside for the sake of someone and this person is water energy here could be yourself or the person Scorpio Cancer Pisces you've got to look at your uh, your uh, general reading and you'll understand what are the star who are these uh, people and their energies something is about to collapse i think we had this yesterday something is about to collapse fall apart but you will be celebrating it you know believe it or not it's been something that's been suffocating you it's been a too much on you 
So yesterday, it was amazing in the reading. Make sure you see the Wednesday 22nd. It showed that there was going to be a collapse, but it was being celebrated. So that was really amazing. Let's see what else you need to know for today, November 23rd. For the collective. Okay, so we have the golden eggs. And... And we have the time. Wow. The time clock is absolutely wonderful. And so are the eggs. But I'll talk about the time first. Divine time. It's time to profit now. Time to profit. And divine time now sees the moment. This is when I say, this is the time for you to profit. This is the time to make money. This is the time to be successful. So use uh, this timing now. Because it's time for you. There's no more waiting period. It's over. This is the time to reach to your profit, to, to everything you want. This is the timing. Just like you have your wishes about to be granted. In regard to your career, maybe you're looking at leaving where you are and starting somewhere fresh. But timing is going to be everything, not only in your money, number one, but also in other matters in your life. Timing is going to be now to do anything, whether you're starting a new business, whether you're... Uh, uniting with someone uh, starting a project with uh, whether you're you're about to reach your goal yes all that is happening this is the time success everything starting over for some of you this is about saving up putting your resources together starting over starting a nest starting a home together starting a living situation starting a business it's all about that it's also about healthcare. it's about insurance it's about opportunities and it could be in regard to careers in healthcare careers that are you know opportunities coming at you from all angles but always remember not to put your eggs in one basket no matter what happens that's very important especially in this time and age now let's go further and see the yin and yang what they want to tell us two messages for november 23rd and this is the first one and now the second one Okay, so we have, okay, we have toxicity. Toxicity is about, um, n perhaps it sometimes is about being stuck or restricted or something has been done too much of. This is the card of the devil and it shows that there is something being done to the point where maybe it's becoming too addictive, too controlling, too traumatic, too much to handle. So I feel like it's time to heal from this, time to release this situation, whatever it is, if it's a relationship or if it's a situation, whatever situation it is, time to let go of this situation, time for it to end a new healing from it. The Ace of Water, the Ace of Cups is the greatest gift of all coming your way. This is the gift of love. This is the gift of renewal and love. This is the greatest gift that gives you emotional fulfillment in every area of your life. It could be the greatest windfall. It could be great money coming to you. It could be uh, everything that will give you happiness in many areas of your life. So you are going to get a lot of your wishes and surprises coming your way that are going to be spectacular for you and healing with that healing also the ace of cups now what i'm going to do is take out the ace of cups and just put it here so that you know what it looks like when um uh, when i'm referring to it because sometimes you won't know what i'm talking about if i um if i don't take it out out of an, a deck that we're not using at this point in time and here it is the ace of cups this is what it looks like so you can have an idea this is the Ace of Cups. So, um, as you can see, the Ace of Water, Ace of Cups, it's the greatest gift of all, and it gives you incredible emotional fulfillment in many areas. So it can be the greatest love of all, it could be the greatest gift of all, it could be the greatest win of all, the greatest, you know, it could be anything you've always wanted, something spectacular. So we've got the Ace of Cups here. Let's have a look at what else you need to know. Two more messages for November 23rd for the collective. So we've got one and one more. Truth. Okay, forgiveness. In some cases, forgiveness is needed. And forgiveness is very important when you're holding grudges or when you're angry. You need to release your anger. And the only way to do that is forgiveness. And the way to forgive is to accept acceptance is the way that can help you understand the situation compassion is another one another um tool that you can use 
when it comes to acceptance and putting yourself in the other person's position to be able to forgive and to release so that you can have inner peace. Very important. This is extremely important. Uh, the other one was the end of an era. There is an end of a chapter in your life and you're moving on to the next level. That's why we have a new beginning here. End of an era. Let's see what else for everybody. We got, I like you. Somebody's going to declare their love for you or they'll, they'll like to you. <laughs> okay. Um, I like you is all about declarations of love. Let me put my glasses on. It's about someone really likes you and the romance is blooming. And there's, go there's going to be a lot of flirting, a lot of fun, a lot of dating and a lot of happiness. But they are going to declare and let you know how much you mean to them. Health, uh, heart, sorry, heart with a key is about welcoming love. So meeting the one, the one. Let's see, meeting the one. That's what we're talking about, falling in love here. Opening your heart, getting together, and it's, it's going to be perfect, absolutely perfect. That is beautiful. That's really nice news. Okay, let's see what else. November 23rd for everybody. Everyone, we've got, it is safe for you to fall in love now. Let's see one more. And it says a heart-to-heart -heart conversation could be bringing those declarations of love, number one. Number two, the more you talk heart-to-heart, -heart, uh, the more honestly you discuss your feelings with each other, the more you will be understanding each other and moving probably to the next level. So that's that one. And the other one is it's safe to fall in love now. Open your heart to give and receive the greatest energy of all, which is love, the greatest energy of all. All right, so that's good news. Let's see what the message is for today for everybody. And it says time. There's the beautiful synchronicity of time. As you can see, when I was doing the coffee cup for the collective, for, what was it for the collective that I was doing a coffee cup? I saw time all over it. Mm, maybe I, I wasn't, I don't know, I can't remember. Now, uh, because I was seeing a lot of time in the coffee, so that's why I just connected twice, we got time. It says you are trying too hard, give it time. Don't try too hard, give it time. It is divine timing. It's going to support you to reach to the level where you want to reach. So don't try too hard. Just give it time and it should fall into place for you right when it's supposed to. Okay, that's very important. That's the message for that. Now, let's clarify the cards, starting with the Ace of Wands. Let's see what the Ace of Wands is for the collective. What is it all about? It's about a new cycle that's beginning. Once you leave one cycle or one chapter, you're leaving it behind. Oh, it's these ones. You're leaving it behind, especially if you were torn whether you should or not. I feel like you are going to be re re relieved from that decision. You are finally going to relocate and move forward to a better position. You're transcending and moving to higher levels in life, money-wise, financially-wise, Happiness wise, there's a lot of joy, a lot of happiness and a lot of acceleration, a lot of uh, elevation. So and there could be travel. Some of you could be traveling and moving. Like I said, where you were torn between whether you should or not, the two of wands come to the rescue. Finally, you'll make the right decision and you're moving forward. It's divine timing now. Everything is going to happen now. You are destined for a lot of rewards, a great victory and a lot of applause and rewards for a job well done. Recognition at the same time. So this is going to be spectacular. Let's move on to the Two of Cups and see what the Two of Cups is all about. For everybody... And the two, oh my God, and the two of cups is about the two of cups. So they are doubling it up and you are destined to be exceptionally happy. Remember the nesting we talked about? Remember we said starting over? I feel like some of you could be starting over with someone, starting a new home together, a new life, a new marriage, a new relationship, opening your heart to love and falling in love and starting a new life with someone who's like your soulmate, someone wonderful, someone incredible. Someone magnificent that you unite well together could be your wish, your dream come true kind of a person. And I feel like um, this could be part of your wishes, one of your wishes being granted. Not to mention the joy and happiness that you are destined for. I'll put this one here. And I feel like, you know, this is the time for you to establish all the happiness you really 
um, a destined for. This is the timing now. This is divine timing. Joy, happiness to the highest level, achieving all that you wish for, starting fresh, and someone magnificent to do it with, someone magical to start a life with, someone incredible and having your dream life, dream life uh, being given to you. Not to mention, of course, uh, what we talked about, uh, dreams coming true. So success is going to be imminent in every way, whether it's a relationship, whether it's a partnership, it's going to be doing spectacular and you are destined for a lot of happiness. So that is uh, magnificent. The end of uh, the end of battles, the end of disagreements, completely, and this is connecting to someone very helpful, someone of fire energy, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. Now we move forward to the next level, or the person that's coming in your life, the soulmate could be, they could have fire energy within them, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. Okay, let's have a look at their dreams come true, wishes come true, the Nine of Cups for everybody. And we have the King of Cups and we have the challenge, the Nine of Wands. It shows that there is a situation where there could where could be one more challenge and then it'll be over. This could be concerning people of water energy such as Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, either one. Or if you've got water energy within you, there is one more challenge and then it's over. A chapter comes to an end, an end of an era. A chapter ends and you start fresh, a new beginning. But to overcome that, it's going to be, once you overcome this chapter, there's going to be a lot of your wishes and dreams coming true and a lot of fulfillment coming your way. So um, this could be concerning, wow, could be concerning uh, water energy, like I said here, like we said, this is wa concerning water energies. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, you've got to watch your, your reading. You've got to watch your general reading to see what's going on in November 1 because I feel like water energies are very much, this is either you are water energy or concerning water energies. There is going to be a major ending, a, a, a grand ending. Something is ending big time uh, because there is a new beginning destined and divine timing is now. So whatever you do, the time is now. Whether it's going to be a great relationship destined uh, to be now, and time is everything, as you can see here. Not to mention, um, where is it? The Ace of Cups that shows that, you know, it could be uh, the greatest gift of all, fulfillment to the highest level. And time is now. You see, the timing is everything. So it could be a soulmate, could be a partnership, someone from your past life that is going to bring you a lot of joy and a lot of happiness. So important to know that joy and happiness is destined here. Now, let's move forward to the next level. Um, and there is one more thing I wanted to say. Very important. But where did I lose it? Ah, oh, here we go. Wishes and dreams being established is very important. Again, the divine timing to get everything you've always wanted is now. And happiness, of course. Joy. Joy to get exactly what you want. Happiness. And your the divine timing is now. They're talking about time is now. And uh, wishes coming true. Wishes. This is wishes being true. And the four of wands achieving all that you want and being in so much gratitude for everything. So success was also there. Remember, success in everything you do is there. And also um, achieving everything with the golden nest, starting over, starting a nest, starting something wonderful, but achieving all your dreams and wishes and divine timing now. So you are going to be rejoicing. You are going to be very happy. Happy and successful, both um, together. So that's that one there. Okay, now we're moving on to, I think we did this part. Yes, we're doing now the, um, the Knight of Pentacles for the Collective. Right, leaving a relationship, a situation or a relationship where you're not happy anymore, where it has reached to a dead end, there's nothing more you can do. It's reached an impasse, there's everything you've tried and it's not working, so it's coming to an end and the truth is going to release you. And it's going to open your eyes to something where you know, this is it, I've got to move on, this is not going to work. You can see the truth. This is going to give you a lot of sadness, discontentment, unhappiness. It's not going to be easy, but you have no choice. You have to move forward. It's an end of a chapter. You are um, 
defending what you believe in. You are asserting yourself and, and fighting for what you believe. I feel like you are destined for a new beginning and it could be a new situation, a new partnership. A new partnership is imminent and I feel like this is where it's going to take you to the next level of um, a new beginning. Remember I said with the fresh start with the, um, with the golden eggs, well, it looks like to me that divine timing is everything in regard to starting over this is starting over starting over with the golden nest golden eggs and with um, judgment card shows healing starting fresh starting in a new life a new lease on life that gives you a lot of healing a lot of rewards and great abundance especially after sacrificing or after going through a lot after trying your best and ultimately being defeated in an area of your life where you couldn't do anymore. It was destined to end. The sacrifices were there, but it just didn't work. Maybe um, time for endings and new rewards. The rewards are coming to the highest level with the judgment card and everything is going to be in your favor. Karma is coming to an end and you're starting a fresh start. So timing is playing a grand role in your life. Uh, with starting fresh and divine timing now whether it's going to be a relationship wise partnership business money whatever it is ultimately you are destined to be in a very great in a wonderful position with the four of wands getting exactly what you need and establishing all that you need a lot of your wishes being granted not to mention also the nine of cups wishes being granted you see and timing is now so you are destined for a lot of joy. You are destined for an amazing, joyous time. Absolutely joy, happiness, and a new beginning. That is going to be tremendous. And it's going to bring you a lot of happiness on top of everything. A lot of joy. So that's that one. Now, my dear viewers, let's see what the Chinese cookies have to tell us. What do they want to add? 23rd of November. So we've got the first one. Oops, and the second one, here we go. Glasses on, and let's have a look. Okay, so it says here planning. It says planning. Now is the time to lay down the foundations for your future. Financial gains are more than likely. Financial gains are more than likely. That's also to do with the golden um, nests about money burnt out. Okay, it says your hard work will see results, but your hard work is going to be recognized, achieved, applauded, uh, you know, um, rewarded in every way. Uh, but your health needs to be maintained. So check with your doctor, dentist and health professional and try to maintain a healthy lifestyle. That's very important. For all of us, me included. Okay, my dear viewers, that is the end of your reading. I do hope you enjoyed it. It's quite intriguing. So much happening here, um, and but the, but overall, there's happiness and success, and there's a soulmate and time to profit now and dreams come true. That's all that matters. A lot of rewards, a great, uh, a great gift from the heavens. This is like amazing. This is going to bring you all the happiness that you deserve and more with the judgment card and with the happiness the four of wands dreams come true i just feel like there's just so much going on so much wonderful great news coming and everything and timing divine timing is now so we don't have to wait any longer we've been all waiting for certain things in our lives now is the time it's it's reached to the time where divine timing is right now to grant us all that we need wishes and dreams everything showing that we will be getting what we truly want or need and that's what's going to bring us all the happiness each and every one of us i'm talking about all of us and that is the end of your reading i do hope you enjoyed it do give me a thumbs up leave me a message let me know what you think of the reading share with you uh, with me your thoughts and Please don't forget to support the channel by subscribing to it and supporting me also. And subscribing, it doesn't cost anything. And also watching the videos till the end because they're becoming longer. I'm slowing down and not only able to speed as I used to before, talk <laughs> speed. I've slowed down over the years now. So your support is really needed to watch the videos till the end 
or to let them run till the end without stopping them because they're too long. Uh, that I would really appreciate your support in that manner. I wish you a lot of love and light and abundance of blessings. Namaste.